All right, hello everyone. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my god, that was loud. I forgot that I don't put that all the whole way up. All right, hello. <sighs> yes, we got it sorted. <laughs> oh, thank god. Um, let me turn that brightness on my screen so I can see this better. Let's ignore the side of my hair. All right. Um, yeah, we're just going to be continuing off with where we left off with our Scarlet Hunts, which is exciting. I'm very excited for that. How are you doing, no lifer? Um, so yeah, uh, I mean, let's get straight to it, really. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna get some shinies today. All right, uh, let's get to our wheel for a start. Uh, where is the wheel? Do, do, do. There we are. Should that do it? Nope. There we go. All right, let's see what we start off with. And we get a non-outbreak. Okie dokie, very nice. Hiya Piper, how you doing? Can you request a Pokemon? Uh, hmm, we'll see, maybe. Well, it depends what it is. Uh, okay, and now we do from this list. Come on, give me something decent, something decent. It's trolled me again. It's trolled me again. Alright, we're starting off with Servine. Uh, I do realise I need to change Oshawott. Uh, nearly nearly got Rampardis again. Uh, this is literally what happened last time it landed on Snivy, and I said no. Uh, so we'll do it this time. We'll do it this time. Alright, let's hide that. Get back to the main screen. There we are. Uh, no, you. I will, I will refuse. Alright, so Snivy. I know exactly where we need to hunt for this, because I have done already. It is around here. It's actually going to be near where Rowlet is. We do actually have a Rowlet outbreak, um, which I would be happy to do. We also have a Lombre, Centret, and Inke. So a decent amount, a decent ones, I think. Well, what is what is your request? What is your request? Um, I know roughly where it is. I just need to make my way there. Bulbasaur. <clears throat> um, is Bulbasaur doable without an outbreak? I, I do have a I do have a Bulbasaur from Let's Go actually, but obviously I don't have the rest of the line, so I suppose it's yeah. I mean it's definitely one that I would consider doing. Yeah, so Raul is going to be okay. So this Raul is just going to be out of range. Snivy starts spawning from around here, up that way. Um, so we will get straight to Sandwich. We don't have an outbreak, uh, but that is not an issue. So they do spawn a lot around here, so we should be fine. That is not what I meant to press. I meant to press that. All right, let's get going. Did you touch another chili? <laughs> Where is the grass sandwich? Oh, it's <laughs> funny enough. It's chili sauce. Uh, we we will see. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do it towards the end, depending on the timing and stuff. All right. So we get rice, um, chili sauce, your favourite, um, olive oil. And then salty. Oh, I need to get some more salty. Um, and either sour or sweet. Uh, we've got one more sweet, so we'll go for that. Lovely. All right, well, let's hope that <clears throat> I can sit in this chair comfortably for the whole uh, stream. It is. Well done. I only know that because of the office. And I can do this, though. It's nice. So when I first sit in it, it's fine. It's just like it doesn't go for ages. Because my back's just not uh, good enough. Alright, the only downside of doing the Snivy Hunt without an outbreak is... Um, Executor pops up quite a lot. So uh, we may end up getting a shiny Executor again. But no issues. I don't actually have an Execute, so I wouldn't mind that. But I'm not sure they're in the area. Um, do I have... Um... I just want to see if I've got the clip of my shiny Snivy. Uh, Snivy, Snivy, Snivy. Snova. Sneasel. No, I don't. Okay. Um, well, before we do anything, I do need to change the uh, GIF. Make my life a bit easier. So, our target is Snivy. Where are you, Snivy? Actually, no, our target is Serving, technically, but we are looking for a Snivy. Um... For my sake, I'm just going to do this quickly. 
Um, hold on. Because this is the screen I'm using, just to make my life a little bit easier. Um, hunt off screen. Because I currently use the hunting for one, but I'm not actually hunting for a serving. So I might as well do this now. Uh, Snivy. There we go. Loop. And we hide uh, you. Put you here. And then go back to that. There we go. Much better. See, I know I know all the tips and tricks now. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Let's get going. Oh, hey, RJ. How you doing? Three to five star G Max Gengar. Ooh, very nice. Wait, wait with a fairy type. Oh my god. Thank you. I so said we. I do actually have my first Snivy. Uh, but I said we spun the wheel, and it it literally went next to Rampardos again, uh, which last week I cheated with and um, ended up going for um, Cranidos, even though I didn't get it. So um, this week I will honour it and, and do Snivy, aka our serving, um, which I'll take. The only issue, as I said, there's a lot of Executor around here. Uh, but there should be Snivy as well. There we are. But yeah, there's a lot of Executor. And obviously, Executor's a lot more obvious. So, a little bit annoying. But that's what the wheel said. So, we believe in the wheel. You know, the wheel, when I spun it, and, and I, you know, I did the hunts last week, I, I got shiny every single time, except the time I chose to do my own one. I didn't listen to the wheel. So, if we uh, listen to the wheel, maybe we'll get some shinies. Um, I just realised I need to make this full screen again because <laughs> my thing isn't there. Uh, hold on, full screen. There we go. All right, there we go. Oh, it's not looping. That's why. Why is it not looping? Oh, because it doesn't exist in this thing. Hold on, I'm off screen. There we go. And then I hide it on this one. Ah, oh, what the hell? Okay, if I just do that, there we are. Now I can see it. Michael McIntyre doesn't he indeed host the wheel. Yeah, that's my that's my beautiful shiny emote. I love it. It's very cool. And to be fair, it is quite consistent. I mean, last week, last week Piper and I were hunting at the same time, and every time you came to the stream, Piper, to tell me you got a shiny, I also found one. So last week we got Blitzel in an outbreak. Then I wanted to get a Zeb Strike because I still had time left in the sandwich. Ended up getting a second Blitzel, which was fine. I really wanted that Zeb Striker. Uh, and we got lucky enough that we did end up getting it, which was awesome. Um, actually, no, Cranidos was two weeks ago now, wasn't it? Yeah, because last stream we did those three. Um, and then we got Charmander as well. We got our first ever Charmander, which is really nice. Yeah, it is nice. It's nice. I need to get some more. I mean, I don't know if... Uh, I mean, well, people would have realised. But one thing I've talked about a lot in my older streams is... That I have to do 60 different days of streaming um, once I become an affiliate to um, have follower emotes. It was only letting me do sub emotes before, um, which means I've said I've finally done 60 at least. I, I, I implemented it, you know, a few weeks back, but yeah, it took its time. <laughs> you know, I said I had 60. This is ridiculous. It's, it's literally just so I can have instant upload eligibility. That's all it is. It's very dumb. Um, I do sort of want to remind myself, I do actually have this, so you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab Snivy in here and put it in my party, just so I can kind of have a look at it every now and then. Uh, we'll drop off Petra Runt and then put Snivy first. So let's have a look. How obvious is it? Okay, it's not super obvious, but it should be pretty clear. It should be pretty clear. I think it's one that's more like you don't necessarily instantly go, oh, that's it. But you kind of just go, oh, wait, that's not the normal one, rather than the other way around, you know? You should do some hunts right now, Piper, I think. Maybe give me some shiny luck, who knows? <laughs> um, but yeah, as I said, and uh, apologies for doing the stream today. I did want to do it yesterday, um, but just had a few issues. Um, so we moved it today. But as I said, today will be longer as a result. Uh, I will still continue the rest of the schedule for the rest of the week. Um, I still will be probably playing Hitman tomorrow. Um, there are some games I'm doing achievements in at the moment, but they tend to be multiplayer games. Um, the ones I'm doing, so they're not going to be streamed. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to continue with Hitman tomorrow. Uh, I need to put this more on me. There we go, if I sit a bit closer. Um, 
and then Saturday we'll be back to Dynamax Adventures. So again, if you want to do join some Dynamax Adventures, uh, make sure you pop around on Saturday. Should be a good one. Hopefully we can get something. Damn, is he that loud? Doesn't like. I mean, I can obviously hear him, but like, I forget how well this mic picks up. Just it's it's not it's literally just anything in this direction. So yeah, it's a bit annoying. I'm gonna move the camera. I I didn't move the camera. I moved the uh, the lighting. But I suppose if I'm talk not talking as much, I think he's on the phone. I've never known someone to phone like people or be on the phone so much. Sounds like he's always on a phone call. Oh, this chair, man. It's nice, but I cannot work out this headrest so I'm actually comfortable. It's definitely better than the old one, but it's still not great. Well, no, he just, pho he just phones people all the time. It's weird. Yeah, so just, to say that, just as a reminder, every now and then I can just be like, okay, yeah, look at it. Like, from a distance, it's almost slightly blue. I know that's a bit of a stretch, but, like, it's clearly just not, like, grass green, you know? Like normal Snivy is. Yeah, I saw it all mine today. Do you know what a random fact about Snivy? Or more random fact about me, but it's related to Snivy. Um... And that is, it is one of the, I think it's one of the two or three Pokemon I've ever tried to draw. Very random. Um, God, this is laggy today, isn't it? Um, yeah, very random. But, um, uh, yeah, it's one of the very few. And I, I'm trying to think off the top of my head, who else? I know I've drawn Pikachu. Because I did it on a skateboard for a charity thing. Apart from that, though, I generally can't think of any others. Or, like, not any, like, memorable times. I'm sure I may have at some point. Okay, I need to take Snivy out of the lead. Um, but, yeah. Because he's cringe. Yeah, I know. I think some... You know, he's he's year above me as well, technically. So, we're in the same year group. But he took a gap year. So, he's actually 22. Which is crazy. I'm 21. Yes. People didn't know that. Yes. You also tried to draw a Pokemon. Guess which one. I mean, this is a lot harder than you just, you know, me trying to think of what I've drawn. Um, Togekiss, Roserade, PZ. If it's not one of those three, then I have no shot. Yeah, it just, honestly, it, like, it's really dependent. Like, just some people are, you know... And you can you can like be adult and you know live a you know you know be responsible and all that for yourself. Just some people are still really immature. Okay, if it's none of them, I have no idea, and it's not Pikachu either, is it? Because outside of that, if it's like if it's not a starter or a legendary, as well, then yeah, I definitely have no idea. Is it starter or legendary? Or not? God of War. Okay, that's. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. I probably would have eventually got there, but it would have had to have sprung to mind, which it definitely didn't. Oh, oh bugger, didn't even see that. Do, 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 do. Hmm. i tell you what, when I'm like not full oh, for God's sake, when I'm not fully focusing on this screen, this screen next to me is OBS and what you guys can see. It's a little bit distracting because I'm controlling this. I can just see it moving over there, but no excuse not to find a shiny. How long have we got left? Twenty-one minutes. Okay, interesting. I need to make a little window. I think. Oh, for God's sake! Because I have my camera over it on this screen, um, over the time, and I have to keep looking over every day, every now and then. It's a little annoying, but I mean, it's not really. A difficult fix. I said I, I probably would have fixed it tonight but as I said I've literally so I got in about my, my, my train got into the station at half past 31 minutes past 5 right I cycled back and I got here about 42 or something I think um, 
And I cycled fast. Like, it wasn't like a casual cycle. Um, got back. Then literally, like, changed. Um, and got it all set up. Took some stuff off my desk and started. So, do, do, do. you thought your vintage was hacked? How come? What did it happen? Well, I said someone hacked my Depop ages ago. I mean, I literally never. I don't think I've ever bought a single item on there. I, I just used to browse for like my old shoes that I really wanted to buy another pair of, or like um, a football shirt every now and then. Um, but yeah, I don't ever use it. But I randomly went onto it recently, and, and someone had been in my account messaging people. Or well, maybe I got an email about it, that's why I went on to it, that makes more sense. Got two emails in French. Maybe it was from a French person. I think that probably was what it was. So many executor, man. Like, things, it's just annoying that obviously this is small. So, you know, they don't stick out as much. And you just, because you see an executor, it just like, you focus on it because you see the bigger Pokemon. I'll tell you one thing I still haven't done, which is a really simple, quick thing. And you know what? I'm going to do it now because I will forget again. It's just having a look at what outbreaks are available because I'm really interested in what um, outbreaks are actually possible. Because I know you can because you can get Frigibax and Arctobax in Paldea. Uh, and I've had multiple Frigibax. I've only ever done it once and I did get two from it. So next time I see an Arctobax, I do need to do it. Um, but like, as I said... Um, I don't, I don't know what's possible. I, I think with the DLC, with how many Pokemon are released as evolutions... Oh, God, I'm going off the screen. I'm really interested to see what's available. Surprised you can do them, to be honest. I get very bored. Okay, let's find out. Indigo Discs, Outbreaks, and obviously the Goat Cerebi. Okay, Mass Outbreaks. Let's have a look. I don't know if it's going to show on... Um, specifically for the indigo disc. I'd like to think it would. There we go, terrarium. Okay, so. It's more about the evolutions, because obviously it's going to have the base. So we can get Alolan Dug Trio outbreaks. Nice. No Alolan Ninetales or uh, Sand Slash, though. What else have we got here? Oddish Gloom Vileplume, I know, because I've got all three. From a Vile One from Vileplume Outbreak as well. And you're having breakfast. I mean, fair enough. I did... Think I did consider taking it on the train to work today, but it's like a 20 minute journey and I, and I just got my phone to be honest. And I usually sit at the end because I have my bike, I like watching it. Um, so I'd rather, and on the way back as well, I, I sit with it just so that if people get on who are getting off uh, uh, later than me, they can put their bike behind mine. A blossom outbreak? That's not bad, especially if you don't have one with blossom, of course. I actually had to reset a few before the stream because. I hopped on and was like, oh, I'll just put in the first one that I don't have a Pokemon for. And in the first, like, three resets, I had every single one. <coughs> I kept getting Deerling, Sawsbuck, and Pyro, so I had to reset it a few times, and then I finally got one, which actually has multiple, so even better. Yeah, Blossom is a really good one. Um, so it's pretty easy to get, though, Piper, so if, you know, you could easily do it, and then it wouldn't be on the goal. I actually got Shiny Blossom a long time ago, so, you know, I got it way before I got... So Oddish, Gloom, and Vileplume... I got all three in their forms, literally in the last like month or two. Um, whereas Blossom, I got like two years ago. I think I got it. I got it in a um, Dynamax Adventure. I want to say actually I got two. I think it was one of the very few. I, I know I got two Maractus, and I've had two Toxtricity as well. It might have had two Blossom, but I might be making that up. But yeah, it's a nice shiny. I do. I do think I like Vileplume more though, just based on the shiny, not the Pokemon. Blossom's a better Pokemon. Anyway, let's have a look at this list. So, Geodude and Graveler Outbreaks. Only Slowpoke, no Slowroll Galarian, that's obvious. I was having a look through if there's anything that stands out to me. Hitmonlee and Hitmonchan, I didn't even, like, I forgot that they were in this game, because you usually have to evolve them by Tyrogue. That's how I got them for the decks. So, that is good in terms of shiny hunting. Uh, you know, I'm just going to pause this quickly, so I have to scroll through. Rhyhorn, Rhydon, Chansey, but no, I should wait, no, it should be be later on. Horsey Seedra, Lapras, Tauros, Magma, yep, all of these are expected. Um, yep, yep, yep. Scizor, Skarmory, Hitmontop, okay, cool, so you can get all three. I've got Hitmontop. Uh, there's Blissey, that's it for Gen 2. Anything surprising? It's, I'm more just looking for Pokemon and seeing if their evolutions are there, so 
Beldum and Metang, which we are aware of. No Metagross, of course. Um, Cranidos and Shield on. No Rampardos. Bust your dog. I'm gonna cry. Um, anything else of notice? A Zeb Striker. I said a very good one. Excadrill. Good one. You can get a Crocodile Outbreak. That is the one I was most look looking forward to. Sandile, Crocodile, and Crocodile Outbreaks. That is by far the one I'm most excited about. That's really, really cool. All right, thank you, Piper. Uh, Scruffy, Gothitelle Outbreak, Reuniclus. That's really nice. I like that. Oh my god, you can get an Electros Outbreak. Electros Outbreak. That's. I'll, I'll have to rehunt that as an Outbreak because that's a really good one. Axiom and Fracture. Anything else that stands out? Um, no Malamar, but you can obviously do NK. Yeah, Electros Outbreak. How crazy is that? Crabominable I thought was a really good one to have as an Outbreak. I have done it, of course. Um, no Alchemy, unfortunately. Okay, that was probably... That and uh, Crocodile were the most shocking. Uh, but they, those are a good mix. I think those are a good mix. I just, obviously, how rare they are is different. You know, I've never seen a crocodile or a crocodile outbreak. But I will, as much as I really, I you know, I, I hunted for those shinies, uh, who I thought were really difficult at first, and then I realised they're actually really obvious. Um, I would love to find them in the wild as a shiny crocodile and a shiny crocodile because I mean, they are is arguably one of, if not the best line of shinies, just because all of different shinies, let's say, because. Like, for example, Dino, you know, Zuelus, Hydreigon, they've all got good shinies, but they are all the same thing. Of different shinies for each single one, I think they're absolutely brilliant. Realistically, I'd say they're different, anyway. I mean, obviously, Crocroc and Crocodile is, but yeah, they're just fantastic. That's, you know, Sandal's alright, of course. Um, not amazing, not as good as the other two, but it's a fantastic line of shinies. My favourite colour eyes, blue, because that's what I have. And I look in them every day, so <laughs> I'm a bit biased. I mean, that makes it sound like I'm constantly staring at myself, but no, I, lo I look in a mirror at least once a day, so, you know. This is going exactly how it went last time. <laughs> In that it feels like there's no Snivy. There is, but it doesn't feel like it. Uh, let's go down here where it's a bit more open. I did actually get my Snivy right on the edge of its uh, of its spawn. Pretty much around this area here. I think I literally got it about here. Um, yeah, once you go past here, that's where it leaves. And the, the Rowlets start to spawn um, even without the outbreak up here. So No, the answer unfortunately is not brown. Unlucky. Yeah, so we still do get them out here. Uh, and they are a little bit easier to spot. Um, this is the terrestrialized one. Uh, so it is not a wild one. Because I think they are. that is the static one. And I don't know how you get else get them to spawn. Because I think if you do a ground sandwich, I think you can get a wild croc croc. I don't think you can with crocodile. Which is why I was... Like, the fact it was a static spawn, I thought, oh, maybe we'll get an outbreak. But I think it's not very likely. So the fact it has one, I think, is really, really cool. Uh I think that's going to be once well, you know, once I start getting more shinies, you know, one of the, some of the most exciting things are going to be what I can catch in the wild, like in what you know as its evolution. Um, so that is very nice. I'm very happy with that one. I would be happier with a snivy though. This is actually the first um, the first shiny I did hunt. Um, oh, it was the first star I hunted. Sorry. Actually, you know, I think it was the first. Shiny. Oh, actually, no, it won't have been because it will be, it'll be on the list. I mean, let me have a quick look. Where was it on the list? Oh yeah, of course, no sizzle was. But yeah, look, it was, it was the second one. There was a sizzle outbreak that I did. So it's the first non-outbreak hunt. I just happened to get an executor before, uh, which is yeah, pretty likely considering how many constantly spawn. Um, oh god, stupid chair. Um, but yeah, so. It was a one I hunted really early, so for all the things on the wheel to you know to need, one of the very few things that I've already got the first thing of, and you know isn't just the baseline, um, or that I've already done in this game. So I think that's the first Pokemon we've landed on that I have already done in this game. Everything else I've either not done at all or done in a different game. So 
yeah, it's interesting that that's, you know, that's what we landed on. But no matter, I do need them all. That is the point. And I can't imagine, a, you know, the fact we're getting wild starters is awesome as it is. I think we've been very lucky with that. There was no way in a you know, million years we're going to be getting wild Servine or Serpiri anytime soon. That's why I suppose let, Let's Go... I really just wish Let's Go had had Luxury Balls because then I could have done it in Let's Go. As much as the mechanics are broken. And obviously there's the other thing of as well that we all didn't know how to do it. So I sort of reiterate this a lot because a lot of people still don't know. But in Pokemon Let's Go, if you've played it, of course, it's easier to understand. The idea is you have these things called catch combos. Um, and, you know, I very feel very much for Johnston because he does a shiny Professor Oaks challenge, which basically catch every shiny Pokemon available before each gym. Basically catch them all in the game, of course, but he had to do it before each gym, so it took a very long time. Point is, um, what we thought it was, so they have these things called catch combos, and you catch a Pokemon, and you get a combo of one. If you catch the same Pokemon again, then you get a catch combo of two. And obviously this keeps going on and on. If there is a... Um, if you catch a different Pokemon, it breaks. If the Pokemon runs away, it breaks. However, you can flee, and it will not break. So the idea was that, you know, the higher the combo... Um, the shiny, and it capped at 31. 31 was the cap, the best shiny rate, because obviously if you get a combo forever, it's almost like a guaranteed shiny. Um, so one one in, you know, 31 of a catch combo, 31 catch combo, gave you in like, one in like 500, 600 odds, or whatever the boosted one was, I can't quite remember. However, the important thing to note is that this is how we used to think it worked, right? Uh, it was a discovery was made by Anubis on Twitter, uh, Sabuna underscore Switch. If you're interested in following, I, I really you know enjoy looking at their posts. Uh, we'll take a break though because that is a shiny Executor who we will save on. <laughs> it's shiny, but not quite the one I wanted. Figured it was coming though. It's quite the most repetitive shiny, isn't it? But like I said we'll take it. It's a shiny. I, I I'm not going to complain. It's still a shiny. Um, it's a little bit annoying, but I'll get back to the story now. Um. Yeah, so the idea is that, you know, people do the catch combo and um, it would it would work so that, you know, you're all the Pokemon you see are of that same, you know, that same Pokemon uh, will have boosted shiny odds. Uh, there was also a thing of um, if you had a catch combo, you were more likely to get other shinies, but they were just way less boosted. So, you know, one in 4,096, it, you know, might be one in 3,000. I think it was a lot lower than that, one in like 3,500, but to be honest, I don't really know. Uh, the most important thing to said to note is that I said we used to think that once you got 31 catch combo, that was where it was best. What Anubis discovered was that um, that only applied to the very next Pokemon you that spawned in. So, if you were to get a 31 catch combo of Squirtle, Squirtle spawns in. That Squirtle has odds of one in 600 being shiny. Then another Squirtle spawns in. That is one in 4,096. Now, people didn't know this for a very long time. Um, and they, everyone knew there was always something up just because, you know, people were going like crazy over odds as they were. Effectively, they were full odds hunting. And, you know, from 600 to 4,000, you know, that is a, it's a big jump, right? Um, maybe, what, like six, seven times, roughly? Um, you, know, over, you know, over odds, that's very unlikely. But that is effectively what they thought it was and how much less likely it was. So if you really go over odds... Um, you know, actually over one in 4,096, then it feels like the sort of odds where it's like 99% likely, you know, if something's one in 10, after like 20 throws, um, you know, it's, it's like, it's likely to have happened, but not that likely, after a thousand throws, it's so unlikely for it to not have happened, you know, um, and it was the same sort of concept, um, so people were very confused, and I said, poor Johnston discovered this after, <laughs> pretty much like, he had like 10 more Pokemon to go in, in, in Let's Go, which is very unlucky, because that took him like two years, that challenge, because he was effectively hunting at full odds for nearly everything. Uh, very few, he didn't. Um, and, you know, I did the same. I I, also, I remember hunting Drowsy, and I got it after like a bit. I can't remember. You know, obviously, I obviously got very lucky, being one in 4,096 ultimately. Um, but, you know, effectively, the, the second one just took out... I spent, like, five hours one day just hunting a drowsy, and I was like, this is ridiculous. But that's because everything was one in 4,096. Um, so if, it, you know, if they did have luxury balls, I would have 100% gone back to the game. But 
They don't, and I have to prioritise, you know, where I can get luxury rules, unfortunately. Alright, we've got eight minutes left. We have got a shiny, uh, so I'm going to have to put the counter up. I still need to do a, a shortcut for. I think I'll probably work out after the stream, if that's possible. I'm assuming it is, but... Uh, however, last time we did this, we did get an Executor first and then a Snivy, so... Fingers crossed we can get something here. I don't really want to leave with use the usage of Herba Mystica and no Snivy. Or just a Pokemon that I've already got, I suppose. Because I wouldn't mind leaving here with a, you know, a shiny Crocodile. <laughs> or a Braviary or whatever. You know, that would still wouldn't be affected by it. And I'd still be a bit bummed that I didn't I got it during a sandwich, but Hmm. I also want to make sure, you know, we do as many as possible just so I can get a load done today. See, I wouldn't mind streaming this two times a week because I really enjoy doing this. Obviously, it brings in less people, but um, the problem is I can't commit to four streams a week, especially once my schedule comes back. So right now, I'm still working and everything, but um, there's very little sport. I have my sport on Saturdays. And that's basically it. My sport on Thursdays isn't the thing at the moment. Um, so, you know, I, I mean, I was considering, I'm still sort of considering potentially changing the days. Uh, Saturday wouldn't change because I don't want to do it on a Friday. I really don't like streaming on a Friday. Um, and also, um, it is shiny. Yes. Come on, I thought it was. I, I, I mean, you saw me pause and stop there. I was like, hold on a second. Am I am I tripping here? Let's go, come on. Shiny Snivy number two. Let's up that counter. Because we did save. Come on. I mean, you, I mean, you must have seen like my, my thought process there. Like, literally, I've gone... I've, I'm talking, talking about whatever, and I've just got... Like, I fully leaned in. That's how you know that I thought it was a shiny, it wasn't luck. Come on. That's what I mean, it's not super obvious, but it's not like immediately, oh yes, that's shiny. It's more of, wait, that's not normal, you know? But yeah, I literally came up to the camera and was like, like looking closely because it felt shiny. So, come on, that's what I'm talking about. You, I mean, you do to an extent, yeah. <laughs> come on, that's what I'm talking about. Ah, not first time. I didn't take it down to lowest health, to be fair. I don't actually know what it has. I should probably just double check, just in case. I don't think... From what I remember, it doesn't have anything. Um, let me just quickly double check. Okay, it has, at level 58... Leaf Storm, Gastro Acid, Giga Drain, and Coil. So we can... Full swipe it down. Oh, I'm glad. You know, I I just so Piper, you missed it. I actually got an executor uh, before, but one of the things I said as soon as we got it was, um, well, last time we did get an executor first and then a Snivy. So uh, I'm very very happy with that. And there we go. There's the extra critical shake, and that is a shiny Snivy, soon to become a shiny Servine. Very very nice. I'm very happy with that one. Off to a good start. Very, very good start. Uh, we can switch this over as well. Uh, I think it's very unlikely we get another one. But, I mean, this is... I think this is actually really nice. As much as I don't like this Pokemon very much, I think it's shiny. Is It gives me sort of, like, Surviper vibes, like, with the the brightness and stuff. So, very, very nice. Very happy with that. Why is my Rampardo Spanish? What? What are you on about with Spanish? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, I'm so happy with that. That's a really nice one to get. I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll play the clip in a minute um, so we can have a little review. What, uh, how long we got? We've got four minutes, okay. Can we can we nick another one? Are we going to get that same repeat? Executor and a Snivy. And then when we finally do this for the third time, we have to get a third Executor first. If we get no Executor, it means no Snivy, maybe. But yeah, that was very, very nice. I'm very happy with that. Um, I should have clipped it on the stream. I always forget to do that. Uh, I should have clipped it on here. 
I'll have to make it a clip myself. Um, because you, it really was like I was mid conversation. I just suddenly went. So this is so it's why it's important to pay attention because it could have that was definitely definitely missable that one. Um, so that I'm very very happy with that. Very very happy. But yeah, I mean, I, I, just, I mean, to be fair, like this isn't anything special. I think a Snivy, shiny. Um, but the Pokemon itself, I do love Snivy. I really, really like it. As I said it was my first non-outbreak hunt in in the Terrarium after I completed the game, um, which was cool. Um, I said it's just funny that we've we've rolled on it again, uh, and soon it will be removed because we should hopefully get Superior sometime soon. Um, but yeah, very, very happy with that one, and we're off to a very good start. Shame it wasn't an outbreak. Could have had that for my grass outbreak hunt, but no matter. We still have Rowlet for that today, so fingers crossed. I mean, I will happily do Rowlet. I've put Rowlet on the list um, of the outbreaks that we can do, um, because although I do have it, <clears throat> and I do have the whole line, uh, they are all in, like, jet balls or something. So... Um, naturally, I um, I would like them in Luxury Balls if I can get them in them. Uh, it's cool to have them unique. I mean, half of me is like, I want just two of every shiny, just so I can have like one in a custom ball or a different ball, something I want to choose, uh, if I can. Um, and then one in a, one in a um, Luxury Ball, but that's not how it works, unfortunately. And a lot of the time, it's just whatever I can catch it with. I mean, my shiny Charizard... Which I haven't taken out of Let's Go and into these games because I can't put it back in Let's Go. Even if I'm not going to be playing Let's Go anytime soon. Um, I haven't taken it out because of, you know, you can't take it back. But that is in a Master Ball. Um, because it was a shiny Charizard when I found it. I think I was on like a Pidgey streak or something. Um, and I was just hoping I'd get those boosted odds, which I did. I, very lucky, very lucky. Um, got the shiny Charizard. It did its fleeing animation. And I was like, nope. <laughs> I am not missing out on that. Um, you are going in the Master Ball, so. Doo -doo. Okay, one more minute. Uh, I've no idea if the Executor has a mark. Unfortunately, the Snivy doesn't, as we saw from the one next to it. You did watch when I got Zapdos. That was crazy. I'm very excited to get another Dynamax adventure. They're, they're, they're I think, a bit more exciting just because... I, like it's taken me way longer and it's also by surprise and it's also not necessarily a target like you know yes obviously when I get the legendary it's great um, but um, you know getting any of them in a Dynamax adventure is just a bit more surprising oh what the clip oh I see yeah I mean I, I said I can I can easily clip it from the stream it's like it's just easier to do it live just I just forget <laughs> Obviously, I clip it. You know, I do the the small video, which I said I I try to do. Um, but yeah, how long we got? Thirteen seconds. Okay, let's just run over here. See if we can get a fresh batch in to spawn as we run around. Anything? No, you're not shiny. What about down here? Any of you shiny? No, you're all executor. Boring. All right, there we go. And now we get the normal spawning in. All right, I mean, that was very, very nice. I'm very, very happy with that. I think that was a really good start. Really, really good start. I know you did. You told me. You'll cry. <laughs> well, I said, you know, that's what I mean. Like, that's what I was so, I was so happy with Heatran. You know, that took such a long time. I mean, like, I can't even remember my Guzzlord reaction, which is a shame. But, all right. Let's uh, swap you guys back. Does this one have a mark out of interest? Because obviously this will decide... As marks help decide who's going to evolve. Okay, this one doesn't, so I don't know who's going to evolve yet. Oh, and it's gone into the right place. Even better. So here's our shiny executor. Again, don't need another one. Does not have a mark. And our bold snivy. There you are. Very, very nice. Very good start to the stream. Alright. Let's save again. Uh, I'm going to put on a jumper as well, because it is getting a bit chilly. It was very warm when I got in, so but I came prepared. Got the jumper right here. Uh, 
my lovely Ted Lasso jumper. All right, let's get this wheel up and get going for our next hunt. Uh, I'm sort of interested to see if we can get an outbreak here. I'd quite like to do an outbreak. Uh, where's the wheel? There you are. All right, let's spin the wheel. And there we go, we are doing an outbreak. And then let's go to our outbreak mons. Oh wait, it didn't save. Damn it, this is the old one. I, I, I changed it, it obviously didn't save. Yeah, we don't have any of these. Car pink was a scam anyway. Um, let me change this to Lombre, um, Inke, Rowlet, Sentry. I'm, I can't lie, Sentry is going to be a little bit of a disappointment. I might have just jinxed myself there, but let's see what we get. It is going to be Rowlet. Okay, the only one I do have of this lot, uh, but it is next door. And it is going to go for our gra grass outbreak sandwich, so... Very, very nice one there. Um, happy with that. Alright, so let's change our thing. Uh, where are you hunting for? So I need to change two, actually. I need to change you. Uh, Rowlet, Rowlet, Rowlet. There you are. I mean, Rowlet's very obvious, isn't it? I, I mean, I don't really need to change it for me. Uh, I know what it looks like. But I will do it regardless. Uh There we are. Alright. And we will change the previous this time. Uh, previously caught. And we will put serving. There we are. Serving so, I mean, uh, shiny is actually quite nice, to be fair. I think it's the orange really works well with the eye and stuff. Alright, let's make our way over to Rowlet for our first outbreak of the day. Oh, I said I'd show the clip, didn't I? Um, I said I didn't, I didn't record it on stream, which I wish I had, but we can check after. But, I mean, I mean the main thing, obviously, was me looking at it closely, not so much the uh, thing. But, I mean, I was talking like this, I was talking like this, I was talking like this. Blah, 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 and I went... Like that, and then it was there, so... Oh, Leona, thank you for the follow. So, yeah, very, very nice shiny to, to, to start the stream off with. Uh, let's make our way over to Rowlet. Is it on a hill? That's annoying. Okay, we'll save and go ahead and go and get going. Uh, yeah, all's good. Uh, we just managed two shinies for the start of the stream, which is very, very nice. I'm very happy with that. Um, especially considering we needed one of them. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I am from the UK. Okay, I need to make sure I remember how to count these. Because <laughs> I don't want to mess this up. I think I'm standing in the middle of the outbreak. So, just being on a hill makes it a bit more difficult to exactly tell where it is. But, alright, there you go. Um, so, I have been streaming almost a year now, actually. I started about February last year, I think it was. Um, I didn't become an affiliate to about May, uh, once I started doing it a bit more regularly. Um, and now I stream about three times a week. Usually not on this day, in fairness. Usually it is on a Tuesday, uh, but I pushed it forward to today due to some other stuff. Um, so yeah, streaming on a Wednesday is certainly a new one for me. Usually we do Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Tuesday is this content, you know, Scarlet hunting. Um, Thursday I tend to do Xbox stuff, um, like achievement hunting or, or Hitman. It's one of the two. Hitman, I've got a few people who watch me for that. Um, if I'm, I, I do a lot of 100% games, uh, so if I'm achievement hunting that week, I might do that. Uh, and then Saturday I do Dynamax Adventures, which is by far my most popular because, you know, a lot of people want to take part. Um, so if you have, if you're interested in that, um, and you have the Sword and Shield DLC and online, you're very welcome to join. Um, and so I do stream those on Saturdays, which are quite fun. 
Uh, I think we're on a bit of a bad streak, to be honest. It's been a while. So, we last got Heatran uh, at about... Was it 197, I think? Um, something like that. But, yeah, it was good fun. Uh, I went to Traitors. Okay, that's fine. That's, wait, that's loads of time. It's like the whole time. <laughs> uh, I have no idea where I am, by the way. Oh, yeah, that's all right. Um, to be honest, I'm not particularly interested in anything. Not right now. Um, I don't really have the money to be uh, funding artwork. Um, as much as I'm sure you're very talented. Uh, I don't... I don't I, I'm not really looking for it right now. Sorry. Um... Okay, we'll get this. I feel like this is just there in the area. I'm going to unsync uh, and just have a re-evaluation of where the thing is. Yeah, I said, to be honest, like, it's not like... Net I mean, yes, money is a thing, but also I'm just not that bothered by the moment at the moment, you know. It's not like I'm some crazy big streamer. Um, you know, I've I've got the uh, my profile picture. Uh, I made the panels under the stream myself. You know, it wasn't that hard. Um, and they look fine, so yeah, I'm happy with that really. Maybe in the future, who knows? Uh, okay, 24, I think. Absolutely no clue. I've really lost track on this one, so the good thing is, I think over 100 spawn, um, so um, we should have a time. It's alright, Piper. It's alright. But yeah, I mean, I think, yes, I'm pretty sure it's like over 100 for the full outbreak, like if you clear the whole outbreak. Um, again, I know this because I was watching Johnston's recent video and um, he was basically just seeing how quickly he could get 100 shinies uh, and he decided that he'd do loads of different methods as well to kind of, you know, make it a bit more interesting. Um, and one of those methods, which was the very last one, I think, because it was just, you know, it's not really good of a method sort of the attentional thing of an outbreak in that you literally clear all of them so um so it didn't, didn't work very well I'm not sure he got many shinies from it but he basically tried everything else so except a static hunt because i mean who who wants to do that especially for a speed run <laughs> seems a bit silly all right i'm saying that's 38 right now whether we're actually anywhere near that i really don't know if i'm honest um We'll just say this is 40, and then continue from there. Do around 65, maybe a little bit more, just because I'm uncertain. Um, I said I really should get the counter for this, but I, I mean, I, I set, I actually set up my automatic counter. Um, so I've actually been doing, I mean, well, and most people know I've been doing Arceus for a very long time. Uh, and out without an automatic counter, which I did the first 5,000 for, which is painful. Uh, it is, you know, just it's naturally painful anyway. Um, so... I got an auto counter downloaded and it worked completely fine. I've just set it up for the first time on this PC and I can't get it to work. So um, I'm not entirely sure if I'm doing something wrong, if I haven't set it up correctly. Uh, so I need to revisit that so I can actually register um, huntings and hunts and stuff. Um, I mean, last time I had an issue it was with um, doing the starters in this game. I just don't think it recognizes the pictures very well because it's not always the same like background and stuff. Um, so I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to be able to get it work at all for that. I mean, it should work for Arceus. You know, I've, I've got it to work in the past. Um, so ultimately, it's just going to be a case of, um, you know, just doing, trying again. And hopefully it'll work. But yeah. I'm not doing Arceus on stream. It's so boring. No one wants to watch that. If I had a second switch, I'd probably just have it in the corner. Um, but I do not. <laughs> as much as I'd love a second switch. You know, I mean, half of me was very, like, I was debating it. I genuinely was debating it. Um, buying a second switch. Um, but realistically, uh, one, I said it is a bit of a waste of money. Realistically. Uh, also, if I buy one, it's very likely that my mum goes, okay, you've got another one. Can we have this one back? Um, you know, so, which I don't really want to do. The whole thing is I have two. So what I may end up doing is, I mean, it's going to depend. It's, ultimately, it's going to depend on how this, this Switch 2 goes. Because if there is a Switch 2, I will buy it. Um, but then it's also a thing of, like, 
If I had a Switch 2, this one will definitely go to my parents. And my sister. They're all just at home, really. Um, but, you know, this is the one I've, I've played on the whole time, so... Maybe I'll just have to buy a slightly another version of these. But the thing is, like, this is a good few years old. We actually bought the second hand. It was in very good condition, but we actually bought the second hand. Um, and it's, you know, it's, it's perfect. Whereas if I buy a second hand one now, it's, I think it's very unlikely to be like this. Um, so, yeah, I need to... So, I mean, I need to... When, when the Switch 2 is announced, we'll go from there and, and decide, I think. Um... But yeah, we'll see. Oh, I just realised I should have waited for that one notice. Okay, uh, we'll end on this one, I think. I think we've gone quite a bit over. But, um, yeah. Ah, oh, bugger. Okay, I think went a little bit over. But it is what it is. I went one. That's one too many. That's annoying. Oh. I don't, I don't know if that actually changes how many spawn. But Oh, well. They always uh, rally the spawn outside of the outbreak as well here. Um... I said, it doesn't seem to be the best outbreak in the world, if I'm totally honest. I'm sort of concerned that a lot of these are literally just... I know it's his effect from the outbreak, but I feel like a lot of them are, you know, different. But I suppose if I did get rid of that many, maybe not. Yeah, I mean, I said, mine is actually very good. Okay, now we're good. Uh, yeah, mine's actually very, very good, so... I'm very, very lucky. I don't, I'm just going to save again. I'm not sure I definitely did. I really wish they had a feature on that you could summon the player to you when you run around as a, as a Pokemon. Make life way better. Thank you. I, I, I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to need it, to be honest. Okay. My shiny Rampardos. It's beautiful. Um, actually, we just did this one. I should be able to do it again. Okay, he is playing music, but it's very, very quiet, so I can't complain. Um, so it's chili sauce, uh, olive oil, salty, and we'll go sour this time. Why not? Okay, that's not so good. Can you hear that? How how loud is that? I mean, if I if I talk, are we are we good? Are we all good? I suppose I if I just continue speaking, that's the way to go about it. Okay. Time to see if this works. Oh god. If I turn it down and I speak... Okay, I think that is better. I think that is better. I don't know if I sound any different, but... Alright. Now I said, let's hope this outbreak is good enough. Um... Is that a shiny Blitzel? What the hell? I mean, how... It's marked. What? What the hell? This is the most random... It's, so it's marked, it's shiny, it's unaffected by the thing. This is the most weird shiny... What the hell? And it, of course it's one I've just literally hunted last week. But like, I don't understand. This is really strange. Uh, I don't, I don't really know what to... But it has, it has a mark as well. Like, do you know how unlikely that is? Because it's not a boost. It's, this is a grass power sandwich. That's really strange. <laughs> really strange. Tip, I said it's typical. It's one I literally did last time. But, I mean, it's another shiny. It is another shiny. And it has a mark. So, this one will be my Blitzel. Um, but that is really weird. 
That is really odd. Uh, I won't change it. I'll only change it, I think, for targets. AKA what I'm hunting. Oh, it's annoying. Why do you have to play it, man? Um, yeah, okay. Um, let's just check. I am doing a grass. Yeah, I, and it, it has a... I don't understand. It's very weird. Very strange. Um, I'm more concerned by it. it just feels like there aren't... As much as I cleared a lot of Rowlet, it doesn't feel like it's a big open space of Rowlet, you know? Um, so, yeah, that is... I'm so confused, like, how how that happened. We couldn't get boosted mark shiny odds on the shinies we were getting. On two shinies, we have boosted title odds. Mind you, a lot of Pokemon in those areas, when when you have it, like... Because the thing is, a lot of people are like, oh, you never get shinies with titles, right? Or marks. Um, but if you actually have a look around some of the ones in the area... Like, 40%, 50% even, they tend to have a mark. Like, I'd say maybe slightly, like, majority just don't, maybe, I think. I think it's the accurate way of doing it. Yeah, this is a really bad outbreak, I'm not going to lie. Um, I think that's the fairest way of saying about it, right? And, you know, so that is why. But the majority, oh, I can't sleep saying the majority. A lot of them do. Nearly, nearly half of them do, I'd say. Around half, right? And we've just got one. And we, we were struggling to get one with those boosts. And we've just got one without any boost. And it's a shiny without being boosted. And it's within, like, the the third Pokemon I saw. Like, that is the weirdest shiny I think I've ever had. Very, very strange. Very cool. I'm, I'm very happy with it. But, like, I'm just so surprised. Just genuinely really odd. <laughs> I mean, think how long it took me last week, and then we've literally found that instantly. Like, and that is that is shiny charm odds. Obviously not full odds to have the shiny charm, but there's no extra boost there. You know, the sandwich isn't helping at all for that. So, yeah, that's just really weird. <laughs> really, really weird. I'm just I'm just genuinely surprised. Like, because that is that shouldn't happen realistically. It doesn't really fit the uh, agenda. However, I must admit, as much as it's a tiny little upgrade, it's one I don't care about. I don't care about if I have a mark or not. Um, I care about getting a shiny of one that I want. Uh, I will save, just you know, just to make sure. I will count this. Um, like I said, I, I save after every shiny now. I think it's just the better way to do it. So, yeah. Um, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, if we can get the Rowlet. A good thing is that it's very it should massively stand out. Which is the important part here. Uh no, we don't want you. Okay. Let's go back in the chair. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it seems it seems to be on the grass. As soon as you go down to, like, the grey part, barely anything, like, spawns, like, directly. But somehow Snivy seems to escape there every now and then. Maybe just spawns further away and then travels over whilst I'm moving. I don't know. It's just weird. Not as weird as that Blitzel, but if we get another Executor from being near where they spawn, I won't be happy. If I'm going to get a shiny now, it better be a bloody Rowlet. I mean, I think me obviously getting rid of that that thing and, you know, saying that may have affected it. I don't actually know how it works. I think it's just a... I thought originally it was just a warning as to how close you were to destroying the outbreak or ending the outbreak. Um, but I think a part of me now thinks that, um, you know, um, however many spawn, you know, within one go... I don't think that's the case. I'm pretty sure that's not a thing, but that's just of sort of almost how I've always viewed it. After I, um, you know, really thought about it initially, because it does feel like there's very few here. You know, doesn't quite feel right. I don't know. I might just be uh, overshooting. I mean, it's an interesting shiny. I, I you know, it's different. I'm just not sure it's different in the good way. I'm personally not a fan of it, but to be honest, I don't really like Rowlet that much. I know it's very, very popular. Very popular. 
uh, and by far the most popular of the of the I mean to be fair actually Gen 7 has got a lot more popular than I like realized like when it started I still think Gen 7 is one of the worst starter lines personally um, and you know Incineroar is a bit of a meme but realistically people love him and realize how overpowered he is in, in certain games um, and then you know everyone just loves Rowlet and Decidueye and Primarina gets a lot more love than I think people realise. Um, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, it's so underrated and stuff like that. So, um, you know, they're actually a lot more, you know, liked than I think I initially thought. But Which is weird, because I really just don't like them, if I'm honest. Like, I know a lot of, I've seen a lot of people on Twitter talking about, um, you know, the best starter trio. Now, I'm not going to give a full list, because I'm not entirely sure myself. If I had to compare each of them to Gen 7, Gen 1, definitely better. Gen 2, definitely better. Gen 3, absolutely definitely better. Gen 4, 1 million percent better. Gen 5, yep, better, definitely. Gen 6 is... Mm, I think... If I, if, mm, if, it depends if I'm basing it off the, the Prevos or not. Or the whole line. Let's say the whole line... Then, even with Greninja, I think I'm still going to say Gen 7 is better. So I think Gen 6 is worse. Gen 8, Gen 8 is hard because I, I, I'm not bothered by most of them. I think Cinderace is cooler than Incineroar though. And, I, and my biggest thing is I really love Grookey. So I'm going to say Gen 8 is better and Gen 9 is definitely better. So realistically, it's only Gen 6 I think is worse than these guys um, so you know I'm confused how Snivy spawns here and then you know Crocroc's just there as well just seems a bit I don't know it's like the, the, the things are overlapping or something spawn areas oh dear I am on 5 hours of sleep in fairness I, I sort of forgot about that I did not think I was going to get up today I had to go into work, which is why I was worried. Somehow I did it. I will never know how that happened, but... Okay. Um... Come on, Rowlet. We've committed to you. Our second shiny grass starter for the day. probably write a list of all the Pokemon I've got left but like in each type so I'm sort of intrigued to know and then obviously I can focus on ones that you know I've got more of so if I had a load of grass it was probably better to do a grass sandwich and you know the random things of that a wild you know full odds Blitzel appears um, you know next to the spawn area where I'd find these amount of grass Pokemon something like that you know um, which is exactly what happened but I don't really think it's a common uh, hunt this place. It doesn't feel like it. It's too hilly. But I am now so, like subconsciously checking every Blitzel. I, I shouldn't. I, you know, it's not unaffected. It's just, I, you know, if that case, I should be checking everything. Um, which I sort of low key am doing. Um, but I have it. That's the most important thing. I have it. I have it from this game. So it's in a luxury ball. It's in this form because it cannot be the previous form. So I can't have, you know, I have to have caught it, you know, from a baby. Um, and yeah. I don't know. But I guess appeal. And obviously Ghost Grass in Decidueye is very, very cool. Yeah, sure. I just don't like it that much. <laughs> Unfortunately. How long are we looking at? 20 minutes still. This is how you know that you're dropping frames in, in or how Scarlet Violet is. Because we started, I reckon, about five minutes in the stream. Which is literally an hour ago. Um, and since then we've done one hunt. Obviously there's a little bit of stuff in between, but not very long. Not half an hour's worth. 
You can take away 10 minutes from that. That's like an unexplained 20, 25 minutes in there. Um, and I think a lot of that goes down to the lag of this game. I am not going at exactly 30 minutes. It's taking me longer. I mean, it's not been particularly bad, but I, I, that is most likely to be the main culprit. You know, a couple dropped frames every now and then really ramps it up. I generally thought I pressed A there. I just sat here, I was like waiting. Oh my god, B, I meant. Jesus Christ. Oh, the tiredness is hitting me. I think that's what it is. Alright. It's just 1808, so... Um, this will probably end... Oh, bugger. Yeah, I'll probably do two more hunts after this. We'll have to see how time is doing just because I can't go on too late. I just like to do four to be honest. I mean we always used to do four. I just think I suppose they probably went a bit longer. Maybe they were the performance was better in the earlier game? I don't know. I need to go back to the outbreak as well. That was sort of the point. Rather than just loitering around anything else. No, go away Zeb Striker. I've got you now. I don't need you again. Ah, oh, these stupid Pokemon. Ugh. I can't help but check. Think about something. Uh, da, 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 da. Come on, round it. Why are there Zeb Striker here? Oh, my eyes. Do, 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 do. What is that under the tree? I was a bit so. Oh, am I still cold? Go away. Jeez, that did not make it any better, I'll be honest. If anything that made it worse. Jeez. I'm so tired. Oh my god. Um, okay, come on. Come on, Rowlet. Come on. Why, is it, why are you not spawning here? Let's do three.
What is in my eye? Ah, oh, okay. Those lights, they're so bright. That's my eyes. Plus, I can't just like half nap off like I would at work. <laughs> no, not true, but. You know. Yeah, I'm, I'm just more focused on something being in my eye at the moment. I don't know what it is, but something is in my eye. And it hurts, and I have to close my eyes just to try and make it less... I did get a shiny, though, yes. Wait, did I up the counter? Snivy... Mm, yes, I did. It was the weirdest shiny as well, like the weirdest one. Uh, so... And I'll just play the clip. And you'll see how fast it was as well. Uh, well, you might have seen it then. Oh, did I not play the... Uh, oh, I didn't play the clip after it. Bugger. Well, you get this clip at least. Mind you, this is a grass sandwich. And it has a mark. So not only is it... Yes, it was. You should have seen it. I can see that you can see it. So it should have come from your screen if you, unless you were looking. Um, but yeah, so... Wait, you must have seen it, right? Surely you saw it. Unless you're really behind. It might be that. It was frozen. Do we try again? What, the stream or this video? Okay, well, regardless of whether you saw that or not, Obviously, it was a grass-type sandwich, and I literally got out of it, and the third Pokemon I saw was a shiny Blitzel, which is obviously not boosted by the sandwich, so I don't know how I've got that. Uh, and even more crazy, we did not get a mark for Rowlet or Executor, who were boosted by the improved title power. Blitzel has a mark, and it is not boosted by title power, so I have absolutely no idea how that's happened. Uh, well, that'll be you, because on my end, it says, dropped no frames... I mean, I can check on my phone. If I join from my phone, it, sh it should showcase. Um, and then you'll know if it's you. And I think it is you, because according to this, there's nothing wrong with my stream. Yes, it was. And it was very unlikely. Because it was, it was found instantly. Oh, he's doing... He's doing and Professor Oak Johnston. Uh, live channel... Okay, I think you're really behind, I'm not going to lie. Oh, and the, the stream's... Okay, on my phone, the stream is like a couple seconds behind. Not even... Barely even that. So I don't know how people take so long to reply. Um, but yeah, so obviously it, it was, didn't have the boost of the title power, so... Yeah, that, that was confusing on how I got that so quickly and like literally instantly and it's completely unaffected. It's shininess and it's mark rarity. I don't know how rare it is to have a mark without a shiny charm, actually. I, oh, shiny charm without title power. I literally have no clue. be interested to see what that, those odds are. Especially if it's shiny. Like the odds of finding a wild shiny with a mark. 
is unaffected by boosted odds through outbreaks or um, sandwiches. Yeah, just it's just annoying because not that many seem to spawn, or at least show up all at once. And this is an appalling showing. Where is everyone? Okay, there they are. They're down here. They're spawning in late. Who made it though? Why did I go so far? Honestly, my brain's not with me today. Brain is not with me. I said it is, it is literally the lack of sleep. I'm just tired. Oh, that's a wild crocodile. Yeah, so there you go. There you go. They can be wild. And an outbreak. I find that so crazy. Because the one the reason I wasn't sure about Electros is because the only time you ever see them, they're around like the crystals in the cave. So I wasn't sure if they were just defaulted to spawn there. And maybe the outbreaks will be on them. We haven't actually seen what an outbreak looks like, but I don't see why there would be an issue. Check out those are shiny. Sorry, I said it. I was thinking about something. Uh, da, 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 da. Just trying to plan some stuff out that I want to do. How long we got? Only seven and a half minutes. Oh, damn. I, I thought we had a bit longer than that. Okay, we need to step on this luck. Or, like, I meant like step on it, but with luck. What's the word for that? That isn't step on the luck. Who knows? Luck step. Some new sort of lucky dance instead of dubstep. That's what we're going with. Oh god, I am cold now. I need to put another jumper on. It's just so cold in my flat, but it's better than having the heating on and wasting money, I think. As much as I'm a very cold person, it's like the worst person for this to be like. So I'd like to get a shiny Frigoraph as a Frigoraph again. Because obviously my only one is as a as a giraffe rig, so I'd like to do that at some point. Yeah, um the Pyrrhal shiny is just basically um almost like Pyro's been shaved, like it's just way lighter. I keep thinking that shiny is applied to Rowlet, except it's a whooper. It's just got the colour scheme how you know it's removed on the other Pokemon. Just, you know, people going, oh, you know, um, I don't know, maybe just hating on Gen 7. I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm on about at this point. I said shiny blitz or did I? Or where did I? I don't know. I just think it looks like Weeper a bit. We're saying about like general resemblances.
Oh, I probably should pause for that. That was stupid. Uh, okay, got f just over under five minutes left to find a shiny. And my eyes are gonna fall off. I really thought that was a shiny. Then. Not a shiny, a Pokemon. <laughs> oh my god. There's something really in my eye. I'm just trying to close it for a few seconds and then hoping it will go, but it does not work. How long? Four minutes. Come on, Rowlet. Help me out here. It's just something stuck in there, I think. See, again, I just thought that was like some weird orange version of Solosis. Like, ugh, honestly. It probably just looks like I'm just constantly just closing my eyes for no reason, but there generally is something in it. Oh. It hurts. Yeah, my eyes really distract me. It hurts. I might need a minute or two after we've done this. Alright, two more minutes. Come on. Focus. Get shiny. Win. All good. Come on, dude. I'm really interested in seeing this Blitzel, to be honest. It's just really taking me by surprise. I was not expecting a shiny Blitzel, especially with a mark. On a day when I was not hunting Blitzel. Yeah, that was a weird outbreak, I'm not going to lie. Not a great position. I think that was the biggest issue there. 
It's just that I wasn't in a very good position to kind of scout regularly or spawn a lot of them in. So I just had a little look at this Brit Blitzel because I'm really confused how on earth I've got this. Okay, it's definitely shiny. And it has the crafty mark. That's what I mean. Like, it's very... I don't know. Very strange. Uh, very strange. Alright, I am going to quickly hop to the loo. Um, so I'll be back in one second. Alright, there we go. Now we're a bit warmer as well. Okay. I'm still really weirded out by the fact that we did get a blitz off there. Uh, very strange. But yeah, anyway. Let's continue. Uh, we need to spin again. So, outbreak or non-outbreak. Not outbreak it is. Step away from the outbreaks and what do we get? Puccina. That is interesting. Because... Oh, I keep forgetting to save this one. Anyway, Puccina is an outbreak, so we can actually go and uh, do the outbreak for it. Which is, you know, coincidence there. And so that is what we will go and do. Uh, now, this is actually in Kitakami, so I will just double check I don't have one. I, I don't think I do. Uh, I know I have a Mytina because I found one, like, randomly. Uh, I said I will double check. No, we don't have one. Okay, cool. Also, I think this is a nice shiny. Classic one. One lots of people know, because obviously you can uh, get an unobtainable one in... Is it Emerald? I think. Oh. Okay. So... 
So, where is this outbreak this way? Right on the edge, damn. Oh god, they're small. Okay, it does look like there are a lot of them though, so... That will be fine. Okay, let's get out the Gallade. Um... No, I want to, I want to sink to Gallade. I mean, it says it's here, right? But there's clearly quite a few over there, so I'm gonna do... Oh, I'm not in the terrarium, am I? Damn it. Oh, well. Okay, let's get this one. Sorry, mate. I'm not sure you're following me. You gotta go. Okay, and now let's let's count this properly this time. Hopefully it shouldn't be distracted by chat. And hopefully we can get this pretty easily. Okay, that's seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Yes, I like the speed, Gallade. Yeah, I mean, I'm assuming these are all part of the outbreak. I don't remember Puchena being here very often. So I think it's like Yan Mega, obviously Wooper, um, and a few other like random ones. Kitty Fly, Illumise, Swadloon. It's a very boring place to hunt them, I must, must admit, but it's a Pokemon I need, so. Okay, that's 19. Where's the time? Okay, I've got a bit of time. Ah. Okay, I'm not gonna bother killing you. There's plenty of Pokemon over here to kill. I thought I'd got a shiny spinner rack. I do forget that even happened. A bit random to be fair. 29. I know it's not bright yellow, but that's still going to confuse me. That's what the uh, swaddle. 31. 32. See Yanma there. Oh, okay, it despawned. Boring. It's like struggling for frames. Okay, we're on 34 at the moment, I believe. Okay. Let's bring up Poochie and whilst we're waiting. See uh, what moves it has if we do manage to find it. Okay, I think that's 43 and this is 44. So it will have, most likely, play rough, sucker punch, take down and yawn. Yeah, take down's the issue. Um, so we'll just. I don't know. Um, Hypnosis, I guess. Forty-seven. Please take a while. Nine. Okay, we're getting that. It's fifty. Fifty-one. Fifty-two. So is it pure dark type? It is, right? Okay, that's 55. Is this just a little dog? I feel bad. 57. I can't believe I found a shiny cutie fly here. I was so lucky. 59. 
And I guess we'll do a few over here. Ah, oh, bugger. <laughs> I don't know why they're spawning within though. That doesn't make sense to me. Okay, that's 60. 61. 62, sorry. 63. Oh, okay, two more. We'll do two more. Uh, let's put Jen up. Finish you off. All right, I don't see any shiny around. So we'll save and do the sandwich. Uh, where is my hunting for? Hunting for, hunting for. Uh, where are you? I went way too far. There you are. Why did that not work? There we go. Okay, there we go. Nice. Um, I have no idea what we do for the dark sandwich. I'll have a look. I shall have a look now. Uh, duh, 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 duh. where's the rice? Where's the rice? Where's the rice? Where's the rice? There you are. Uh, we need. What do we need? Okay, I think that is mayonnaise. Ugh. Oh no, wait, that's yogurt. No, that's yogurt. Because I got baited last time and I couldn't see anything else that would have baited me. So, and then spicy. Uh, where is it? Yogurt. Salty and spicy. Alright, there we go. <laughs> and put that on, lovely. Put this on. Uh, what am I reading? Hmm. Okay. This should work, hopefully. Oh, I just realised. That is on the screen. <laughs> Don't want to see in that. That's the, that's the downside of not people not being in the chat. Oh, I notice now. Um, that was definitely dark, right? So we can just check. It is indeed dark. Lovely. All right. Um, hopefully we do just get the. Uh... <coughs> the outbreak spawns but there should just be other spawns as well because this is the only one that spawns here so you know like all the way out here we are still going to get spawns um if we can stay in the vicinity um we can just get the outbreaks um the only downside is i would picnic reset because so we spawn here but obviously they're constantly running towards you um and i'd have to be moving out of the way so i think they're the safest bet because they won't spawn on the road which is a little annoying just in terms of where I have to run to kind of reset it. Um, to reset the outbreak spawns, but as I said, we should be fine. I think to reset them, I'll actually go this way. Because um, we should see a load here. Or at least a good few. This gives me plenty of space to, to redo it. Uh, hmm. Just 
I mean, it should be pretty obvious, right? I mean, I'd expect it to be. Well, how like calming this place is. Trams a little bit more, duh, 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 you know, certain areas. I think. Uh, I mean, it should stand out at least. That's the upside of one of the ones like these. Is that is a, you know, it's pretty obvious. I mean, I think it should stand out, you know, in the grass, let alone, you know, amongst the other Pucciano, just because, um, even though it's very, you know, contrasted colour, um, to the, you know, the Pucciano, it should be also to the environment, I think. It's just a shame that this outbreak's right here, because it's like a bit of a weird position. Can I, can I go up here? No. Okay, that's not part of the game. I wasn't sure. <laughs> Didn't think it was, but you never know. Yeah, so effectively we're resetting the outbreak each turn. But we're also getting quick looks at, like, wild ones as well. So these ones out here won't have as good odds as by where the outbreak is, even if uh, the outbreak doesn't seem to be massive. Yours never change. Of course, I could, you know, I could just get a pooch in over there. Um, but so it's more about the outbreak because it does give me better odds. So it's obviously more worth it, and quite a lot better odds. Come on. Where are you, Pichana? It's too hard to tell. There's so many of them, that's the thing. See that, I, for a second, genuinely, I was like, oh, this, this shiny there, but hidden the flowers, but it's literally just reflection. And that is how crazy Pokemon makes you go. Hi, Piper. Twenty-five minutes. Not anything good for the first five minutes, unfortunately. It was very chilly. I am sitting still and I haven't eaten though, so that does affect it. I'm also very tired. I'm on a few hours of sleep, and it's hitting me all now, which is fun. Eat now? No. <laughs> Obviously not. Um, I haven't really decided if I'm still going to have a proper meal. Because I could just be really lazy and have something like beans on toast. Um, just because, you know, it's been you know, been at work the whole day and, you know, squeezing in a meal. Because um, also, the, you know, it would take me like five, ten minutes, not even that, just to have my food in front of me. If I do anything else, it's going to be at least like 25, 30 minutes. It's also more effort, there's that to consider, but... How did I find it? Um, it was actually the Dynamax server that I'm in. Someone, I think someone said, oh, um, I'm in the server that does Herb Mystica. Do you want to, do you want to join? So I said yes. I suppose the follow-up question might be, where did, um, you know, how did you get into the other one? And honestly, off the top of my head, I can't quite remember. I want to say it was something to do with... I feel like someone joined the stream and then said, Do you want to join the Dynamax Adventure 
something. I think that's what it was. I can't remember, but... Something along those lines, anyway. Yeah, of course, I'll send you an invite once we're done. I keep seeing, like, flowers like that. Like, they popped up there. So as much as it's not that bright, it's still annoying. That I generally thought that was a shiny then. It wasn't even a Pokemon. This is actually a um, non-outbreak hunt I span for. On the non-outbreak wheel. Uh, we just happened to have an outbreak, so I figured... Might as well do the outbreak. And this will de this is away from the outbreak, so those won't count for the outbreak. There they go, spawn. It's only over here. Which I'm really not sure how many of these are part of the outbreak, but I should really just look out for that vestige of like Oh, you've not that have many of the outbreak. What happened there? That was weird. Uh, come on, Pichina. I've got your older brother slash sister. I can't remember what my Tina is, the one I've got. And it was fully formed. It wasn't even hunting. It was just in the wild by complete luck and chance. Which is great because I love my team. It's one of those ones they should do an evolution for. Although we didn't get, well, actually, no, we got actually no, we did get a few actually. I was going to say we got none in Gen Nine, but we did get a few because I was thinking they've mainly focused on like the convergent lines, like Toad's Crawl, Wug Trio, etc. Um, and something else I can't remember, but obviously they have. The Dunsparce, King Gambit, Giraffery, Giraffery, Giraffe, sorry. You know, there's a few. Probably another one as well, I've just forgotten. You know, as much as I'd like to go for longer, I might have to end after this one. Only because, like, I'm genuinely struggling to stay awake. Well, not as in stay awake, just have my eyes open. Like, I'm so tired from, well, not having enough sleep, I suppose. <laughs> just get up so early on Wednesdays, that's the problem. It's also the, like, when I stream, I have, you know, very bright lights on. So that I can be seen well enough by this rubbish camera. Um, and that also does a big strain to your eyes, I must admit. God. Okay. Um. Hmm. Come on, Pucciana. I just want to know how far out of the like from the point on the map it says that the outbreak's counting. Because I, mean, I can easily get one outside. It's just more, way more likely inside. They're so small, man. It's so hard to, like, just see where they are. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, we went really far down. Oops. I did not mean to go this far down. I keep hearing this thing as well. It's, like, really annoying me. It feels like it's some sort of collectible in another game, but it's literally a terror raid. Oh, wow, two people on my friend list going on Violet. 
It never happens. I have barely any friends on the Switch. I just haven't added people. I bothered. Okay, just chill. They're small. I'm gonna keep running into them. Ah, oh, for God's sake, I just did it again. No, that is exactly what I programmed this for. Why did I not do that? Okay, 18 minutes. Come on, Poochiana. I just got to get baited by the flowers. Why are the bright yellow flowers here, man? How ridiculous. Oh, nice. I don't like where it is, to be honest. It's just that these flowers pop up and I just see yellow, even if it's the wrong shade, shape, whatever. You just see it and you're like, oh my god, it must be a Poochiana. And then it's just flowers. Oh, you also have a Rowlet. Damn. You've got similar... Someone outbreaks then. Oh, ow. That hurt. Do you have a Sentra and an Inke as well? Is there my other ones? Oh, for God's sake, I just keep running into them. It's very annoying. Ah, oh, it's not the same then, unlucky. Yeah, go for it. Well, it should be obvious, right? My Tiana was. It's just annoying because I keep just walking into him. The only thing with my Tiana is, well, of course, I wasn't actually hunting it, so. It's easy just to come across a shiny that's quite obvious, but when you're hunting it, I feel like everything can blend, but I suppose. You're probably going to pick up the colours anyway, but... I don't know, I'm still not exactly confident in my art. Um... Come on, man. 15 more minutes. Come on, Putin. Just keep getting baited. I need to go to bed early on Wednesdays. I'm just so up, up so early, I'm just, you know, knackered the next day. And I'm really feeling it now. There's nothing more I want just to lie on my bed right now. <sighs> oh, come on. Where are you, Poochana? Somewhere, come on.
thinking about the stuff slipping my mind. Um, come on, Poochina, help me out here. Make my life easy, please. Give me shiny. Also give us that dark outbreak that we're looking for. Dark mono type here, of course. Never even clock just has a red nose normally. I thought it was part of the design, like some quirky addition, like some other Pokemon that I can't think of. Get the shiny. Brain is frazzled. Oh, I didn't see that one. I keep thinking is it like a shiny and then I just realise it's the one I've got on my screen to help me know what I'm looking for. Oh dear, this is a mess. Absolute mess. Nice one. I'm glad you finally got it sorted. I am half falling asleep, I'm totally honest. It's really hitting me now. Like genuinely my eyes hurt, but that's because I just was up too late. And I got up so early. <laughs> so it's just hitting me now. Is that? Uh, it's not. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Like I said, I, I, I'm, I'm on five hours of sleep. So. Yeah, not good. <laughs> so it's, it's not as bad, like generally. Like I said, you know, I've got through the day relatively alright. Uh, the main thing is just that obviously these. One, I'm focusing on the screen a bit more. But also, the, these two very bright lights to you know help light up because of my camera's not being very is not very good. Uh, that really adds to it. I'm not gonna lie. That's cool. <sighs> hmm. Come on, Poochin. I thought this would be a quick, easy one. I'm not going to lie. I thought we'd get a little bit lucky, get it, and it would be really obvious. It's 
Not even close. You know, we've, we've done two thirds of the way. Hmm. I need to give him no life for his shiny win, but he left, so. Guess I can't do it now. See, I'm checking over here, but realistically, I should just be resetting over here. The best odds are by here, so. Unless you're a Pucciana trying to call me, uh, I don't think you are. I don't think like the, the temperatures helped at all because when I got in I had a bit more energy just because I was like I cycled home fast you know I was very hot like that helped whereas now I'm cold and you know I sat down here for like an hour and a half and to be fair we are already over two hours so it is more than what we usually do so I know I said I did a bit longer but um, that's, I'm just knackered yeah, we, I mean, we still, we're still over two hours, which is crazy. Oh, come on, man. Oh. The thing is, I'm actually relatively comfortable in my chair for the first time in a while so there's that I suppose um, six more minutes come on Pucciana do you think this is a horrendous spot for an outbreak at least there isn't any in the wall, from what I can see. We'll try and have a look. Uh, da, 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 da. I just thought that was like a pony like bending over to eat the grass. That is Jesus, that's not good. Uh no, wrong button. Four and a half minutes. Come on, Poochilla. Well, if this doesn't go to plan, we did get a Snivy today. And I think that's the most important part. Definitely harder to see than this. Not not a hard to see Pokemon, I'd say, but maybe a slightly harder, but, you know, Poochin's like crazy level. Especially early game, like or early game, um, like old games. Ten Herba Mystica. Nice. 
So I'm sure I'm sure the Blissey one does like eleven or twelve. It's just you don't always get into that one. So I was, was going to say two full sandwiches without a shiny, but, you know, we did get that Blitzel at the very start of the last one. It's been basically an over an hour, but, you know, obviously it wasn't actually affected by the shiny charm or the sandwich, so... It was affected by the shiny charm, sorry, but it wasn't affected by the sandwich, and we get we got a title and a, you know, a director that she within about ten minutes, so... Don't really know. Doing Cetus though. What on earth is that? It's a toddle, do you mean? I can't remember when I did a toddle now. I think it was when I did on stream. I feel like it was. Maybe it wasn't. I, I have no idea. Two Satoddles. So it's just a title, unfortunately. <sighs> oh, come on. There's got to be... I really thought we'd get this. A minute and a half left. We haven't had one. What the hell? What? A nice bit of rain. Make me more sleepy. Okay, 50 seconds. Can we end with a shiny, maybe? Be very lucky here, I think. Hello. That was anticlimactic. I thought we were going to get a shiny, to be honest. Oh, well, we did not. So it's probably good timing. Oh, I really thought that was it then. Because um, I'm knackered and I'm struggling. I've had a long, tiring day, so. We should end that there. Alright. Um, I'll need to switch over to face only. Oh, zoomed in. I've like, got thunderous and tornadoes and zip on behind me. How very nice. But yes, yeah, so I'm knackered. Um, I need to eat. I haven't had dinner yet. Uh, I'm glad we could do the stream. Uh, I will be streaming again tomorrow. Um, probably Hitman. We are at the end of a campaign, so I might as well just finish that campaign. Um, and then I'll be back for Dynamax Adventures on Sunday. Sunday? Saturday. Sorry. Uh, thank you for the new follows, uh, the interaction with the stream. Um, hopefully I'll see more people around. Um, s oh, wait, hold on. Did you get a shiny? Damn, that, that was fast. That was very fast. Well done. <laughs> uh, nice. Unfortunately, said we got what? We got, uh, we got Snivy. 
Uh, and then we got a marked Blitzel and an Executor again. So, and it was the Sotodal. Very nice. Well done. Um, so, yeah, three for us today. Uh, one improvement in the shiny, Living Shiny decks, which is nice. Um, but, yeah, no, no improvements elsewhere. But as I said, I will be back uh, tomorrow uh, and on Saturday. Uh, just, yeah, the usual schedule. So, apart from that, uh, thanks to everyone who watched today. And I will see you, hopefully, very, very soon. So, yeah, bye now. See you later. Bye-bye for now. See you later.